Since Kate Middleton met Prince William, the Duchess of Cambridge hasn't been caught up in many scandals. But then, In Touch floated a cover story claiming that Prince William had cheated on the Duchess with her friend Rose Hanbury. Here's what's come out about Prince William's alleged cheating scandal. While Prince William reportedly laughed off rumors of an affair, Kate was allegedly gutted, according to a tabloid report that ran in The Globe. And pretty much only The Globe, which doesn't exactly have an astounding track record of truth. Still, according to the report, the Duchess of Cambridge was allegedly so rattled by the gossip that she went to stay at her parents' home in Berkshire, where she collapsed in utter grief. In a dramatic series of events, the Globe claimed that Middleton refused to eat and, quote, locked herself in the bathroom while crying hysterically. Her mother reportedly barged in after an hour out of concern and found her daughter crumpled in a heap on the floor. She then allegedly revived the Duchess and called both a doctor and Prince William, who rushed to her side where he was promptly screamed at. By the time Rose Hanbury came around, most people forgot that Kate and Prince William's relationship hadn't always been smooth sailing. Prior to their 2010 engagement announcement, the Duchess was dubbed Weighty Katie. It did, after all, take many years. During this time, William wasn't exactly a model boyfriend, at least if you're going by the tabloids. In 2007, the pair hit a rough patch and split. The Daily Mail subsequently published a report about the so-called truth behind their breakup. William was cursed with an alleged wandering eye, just the kind that would later resurface during the royal cheating scandal. The source claimed, he is only 24 and simply wasn't ready to settle down. He has always had a roving eye, far more so than Harry, who was meant to be the family playboy. That's something Kate has always known and accepted. It was part of the deal, if you like. This was around the same time that William was spotted in a London nightclub getting cozy with a mystery blonde, and he'd reportedly been chatting with a well-connected young woman for months, according to the Evening Standard. The latter was said to be a serious flirtation, but obviously it wasn't that serious, or Middleton wouldn't be a duchess. By now, the alleged feud between Prince William and Prince Harry is well-documented tabloid lore. The Sun has listed a number of theories between why the brothers were allegedly on bad terms. This included Harry and Meghan Markle's exit as a senior member of the royal family, best known as Megxit, as well as William's alleged disapproval of his younger brother's relationship. But one journalist has theorized that Rose Hanbury was at the center of the boys' reported brawl. According to Mickey, journalist Nicole Cliff floated the idea in a series of now-deleted tweets that William spilled the beans about his alleged affair with Hanbury to Harry, and the ginger prince lost it, especially considering their father's own affair. She wrote, Wills would absolutely have told Harry about the affair because of how those two are, and I think that Harry was like, this is exactly what ruined our childhoods. This is pulling some dad shit. You have three small children, what the f as brothers, you know, you have good days, you have bad days. Of course, there's no evidence of this, and according to The Sun, a royal spokesperson delivered a hard denial about any issue between the royal brothers in January 2020. If Kate actually cut out Hanbury, you certainly wouldn't know it. The Duchess has been spotted with her so-called rural rival on multiple occasions since In Touch publicly revealed the alleged affair. In other words, the pair have either mended the fences between their neighboring estates, or the whole thing was made up by an American tabloid. According to Town & Country, both women attended President Donald Trump's state banquet at Buckingham Palace in June 2019, and Hanbury was reportedly seated somewhat near the royal couple. International Business Times called it an awkward reunion, but was it awkward for the aristocratic frenemies or the tabloids who apparently made up their feud in the first place? A few months later, the pals were spotted attending church. According to Tatler, both Hanbury and her husband joined the royals, and the whole thing looked amicable because the group was reportedly smiling. Queen Elizabeth II doesn't explicitly have say in the Cambridges' marriage, or whether they divorce, but her opinion certainly holds weight. According to Pop Sugar, she did write letters ordering Prince Charles to divorce from Princess Diana amidst his cheating scandal. She even let Diana maintain her title post-divorce. With this in mind, the Queen allegedly hasn't done any of that for Prince William and Kate. In fact, she's reportedly putting her full faith in the pair. In an interview with OK, the editor-in-chief of Majesty magazine revealed that the Queen is sad but pragmatic about royal divorces. 
Overall, she allegedly believes it's, quote, too easy to get divorced, but was still counting on the strength of the Cambridge's marriage in the wake of a series of disheartening royal splits. After all, three of Queen Elizabeth's four children are divorced. It only took a couple of months for these royals to put the cheating rumors behind them. While various tabloids reported that the Cambridge's marriage was nearing divorce, Prince William and Kate ended up actually coming out on top. By June 2019, the couple's union was reportedly going strong. According to a source who spoke to Us Weekly, Middleton reportedly found the rumors hurtful and wasn't thrilled about the fact that one day, her children would be able to read about the gossip online, but she refused to unravel. The source claimed, "...the rumors forced her and William to sit back and examine their relationship, which they realized they should have been doing more often." A second insider told the publication that the pair was, quote, "...determined to pull through it and are doing a great job at getting their marriage back on track again." Check out one of our newest videos right here! Plus, even more Nicki Swift videos about the royal family are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.